What's up, nature freaks? What's up? Dave and Jeremy back again for another Saturday slap in the face. Today's episode is all about metal and snakes. Yeah, man, we are headed to the city of Chicago where we are going to be working with the hardcore metal band Great American Ghost, providing them with some snakes in their new music video, Altar of Snakes. That's right, so get ready for some behind the scenes action. Get it! <laughs> Alright guys, we are headed to the city of Chicago. Got the boxes loaded up. Dave at the helm. Here he is. Now a lot of preparation does go into this. We don't just go in and take every snake that we own. We take specific animals that we know are going to be very calm around people that we can easily manipulate and get them to work without them feeling stressed out because they're around people all the time. Number one safety is for the animals concerned. We do not want the animals to be overly stressed to get injured during the production on a hot light or a candle whatever may be in the background that the animals are going to be moving through around and number two is the safety of the people obviously not everyone likes snakes all right especially um, people who don't deal with them daily even if they're covered in tattoos hard music we have to protect everybody what do you think Dave? yeah and this isn't our first rodeo this is stuff we do a lot these animals are in front of cameras television in this case, music video, and I'm more concerned about the people injuring our snakes than the opposite, and that's because we're gonna be there to supervise. We know they're friendly snakes. I don't want a snake to get dropped. I don't want somebody to step on one, so I worry more about that. And what's really exciting for me personally is these animals become immortalized whenever we put them on television or in a music video. Potentially millions of people are gonna be viewing this. We're gonna be able to look back and see these snakes long after they're gone, which is really exciting, really cool thing. All right, so when we get there, we're gonna unload. I can already see the city in the background. So I hope you guys liked the video. Hope you liked the behind the scenes atmosphere and, and what we do with the animals. So I'll catch you in a minute. All right, guys, it's go time. Three minutes till snakes in the video. That's right. I'm about to go through this door into the studio. It's gonna be a little smoky. They're setting up the ambiance. If you think every location where a music video is filmed is at some lavish or elegant space like some fancy hotel, you would be wrong. Picture a cluttered and musty basement instead. Each scene that is filmed takes place within a small area without showing too much of anything else around it, creating the illusion of a larger, more elaborate atmosphere. The first thing we needed to do was to check out the area where the snakes would be placed. Right away, we noticed breakable objects and candles, which could be hazardous to the snakes, so we knew we had to be extra careful once they were placed on the altar. Although our snakes are well trained and easy to work with, we needed to find out if the band members were comfortable handling them. Fortunately, the lead singer Ethan Harrison had no problem interacting with the snakes or having them crawl across his body, which was something he was required to do in one of the scenes. So, um, what gave you the inspiration to write a song about snakes? Well, it's not really about snakes, it's yeah. actually about people who act like snakes. Really? All right. Yeah, All it's right. about Got the government, it. you know? It's about the government and how they're slithery and, and slimy, etc. I like et it. I like no, it. Forgive me just, for being so ignorant. I, I did no just idea. hold a snake and it wasn't slippery or slithery. No, slimy you know, actual snakes don't fit the narrative. No, they're very sweet. There you go. And so, uh, this video is going to come out sometime around Christmas? That is the plan, yeah. Because nothing says Merry Christmas like <laughs> an awesome great American exactly. ghost thrash yes, song, right? Exactly. Like a, like a song with a bunch of breakdowns and references to like the government being awesome. Alright, let's do all the snakes. Let's do all the snakes. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's get, get the snakes! snakes.
lot more. <laughs> we can send him back that way. Maybe he'll just come into frame. Okay. <laughs> Down the I'm yeah, the way down. Dueling snakes. Now all I'm saying is light stand. Yeah. Um, we'll do that for fifty percent. Okay, I got it. It's always challenging working with a film crew, making sure we understand exactly what the producer is envisioning a particular scene to look like. In this case, we needed to position the snakes and manipulate their movement to coincide with what they were looking to capture. This was by far the most intense part of filming and Ethan handled it perfectly. Yeah, throw it in there. Make it up, make it up, make it up. Alright, Gary, you get this one there. That's huge. My little boy. Big boy. Big boy. Dude, I'm with you, dude. I am with you. Here you go. Alright, guys, a few things. First of all, we'd like to thank all the members of Great American Ghost for letting us be a part of this video. It was super fun, super cool. Make sure you check these guys out. Get on YouTube, they're awesome. Love their music. Jeremy, what do you think, man? Yeah, you guys gotta check them out. They're awesome. Check out the double bass going, right? This guy right here. Yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> screaming here. That's right. And the bass and the guitar and the scream, all this stuff. Don't want to leave anybody out. Thank all you guys, guys for your help on the video. Thank, Thank you guys so much. Thank you. They're, They're amazing. Your face. Subscribe to our channel. Get on theirs and watch some videos. Nature in your face!